Um, hi guys, welcome to this video. This is Dennis from Spot at Home. Today here in Valencia, we're gonna be seeing a really, really cool property. Okay. Um, so first off, um, we're gonna check out briefly how the distribution of the apartment looks like. Okay. So we go through the entrance door, uh, just cross the um, main entrance door, and we head into the living room, kitchen area. So uh, we'll have this kind of entrance, living room, and the kitchen area all together in an open space. If we would follow the entrance pretty much in a straight line, we would head into bedroom number four. And if we cross the living room and turn into the left, as we'll see in just a few minutes, we've got kind of a corridor where we've got attached to it um, bedroom number three. And if we go this corridor, uh, just one or two steps um, further, we'll find the square where we find divided the rest of the apartment, okay? We'll find um, two bathrooms, bedroom number one and bedroom number two. So to sum up, we find four bedrooms, two bathrooms, we got living room and we got a kitchen, okay? Everything um, fully equipped, really, really new um, decorations as we'll see throughout the whole apartment. Um, decorations on points, really modern, really cool to stay in here. We've got a really nice floor, really nice colors going on throughout the whole apartment. And also um, bedrooms, living room, kitchen, all match perfectly, so that's always a plus. We also got AC units, so really important feature as you can imagine, especially uh, for the summer. And it's also um, exterior apartment, so uh, we got majority of the bedrooms heading into the street or with street views, which are really, really cool. Also, as we mentioned, everything's fully equipped. We got desks, we got wardrobes, we got lights inside each of these um, bedrooms, so we can study, we can work really, really easily. Also, um, we're situated literally kind of like uh, five to ten minutes walk away from here from the beach area. And if we go to the other um, side direction, we also find. Uh, kind of the university area of Valencia, one of them, so that's also really nice. Um, overall, uh, we got a really young um, lifestyle over here, we got a lot of activities that we can do, we got also a lot of restaurants, uh, we got also a um, station of El Cabaña, so it's really nicely connected to with the public transport, so overall, really, really cool um, place to live in, okay? So we're gonna just place ourselves over here to see a uh, brief distribution of the apartment, okay? So entrance over here, we would come inside of the apartment. As you mentioned, in a straight line, we would find bedroom number four. To this side, um, living room area over here and the kitchen area over here, all together in this open space. And if we go through this side, we find bedroom number three. And as we mentioned, this corridor, okay, which is a few steps long, which leads us into this squared space, rectangle space, okay. We would find bathroom number two, bathroom number one, bedroom number one, and bedroom number two. Okay, so we're gonna go back in over the entrance space, and we're gonna place ourselves just exactly on this spot, okay? So this would be exactly the views um, from the entrance. So we go in, okay? And we're gonna start off checking out this side first. We find a couch, okay, really neatly settled. We got a mirror on the top, which has also a pretty cool style. Okay, to this other side, and in front of this couch, we find a table surrounded by four chairs. We got some nice decoration also in the middle of the table. Attached to the wall, we got a smart TV, so that's really nice. Okay, over here we got an extra couch, also with some pictures and some lights, really neatly decorating this side. AC unit, super important. Okay. And if we turn, as we mentioned over here, we have the kitchen, okay, which is really cool. As you can see, we've got really nice colors um, throughout the apartment. And starting off to this side, we see that we got cooking fire, we got a oven, we got several different drawers, we got a kettle, um, we got our microwave, okay. To this side, we got a lot of windows, so that's really important. We can cover windows up too, so pretty important and useful too. And to this side, as you can see, we can hang our clothes so they can dry. Now continuing over here, we find some really nice decoration. All right, turning to this side, we've got a washing machine. We've got our sink. We've got a fridge in this really nice uh, kind of white zone. Okay. And before heading into this um, left-hand side of the apartment, we're going to go over here to check out bedroom number four. So as you can see, we got this built-in wardrobe over here. We got this chest of drawers to this side.
Okay, so go inside um, bedroom number four. We got first off this built-in wardrobe. Okay, we got this kind of chest of drawers over here, which has a pretty cool style in decoration. To this side, we find a desk. As you can see, too, uh, completely brand new. We got also a light. We got some flowers. We got a chair. We got AC unit on the top. And to this other side, we can see that we got double-sized bed with bed lining and some towels included. Okay. Really, really nice and neat. We got a rounded table. And over here, we got these windows, okay, where we find these views, which are pretty cool. Okay, now we're gonna head to this side. We're gonna go through this corridor that we mentioned before, okay? Go in a straight line, turn to the right, and we find bedroom number three. As you can see overall, uh, we got the same kind of decoration throughout the whole apartment, which seems super cool. First of we see this desk with the lights and a chair. We got this built-in wardrobe over here. Okay, where we can see that we got a lot of space and also more equipment. To this other side, we got double-sized beds with the bed lining, um, some towels included. Also, we found a rounded table with some decoration on the top. And to this side, we've got a window, which uh, pretty much has same views than the previous bedroom. So really cool, this kind of park area in the center. All right. And now we're gonna head into this um, corridor. Okay. Um, we're gonna check out first bedroom number two over here, okay? Okay, so entering to this side, we find Double size bed, which is really, really long and wide. Okay, as you can see, super big. We got a bed lining and some towels included. To this side, we got some shelves with a light. We also got another light over here with another shelf and some plant decoration. Over here, we got a really nice setup of pictures. Turning to this other side, we got this standalone wardrobe, okay, which is also pretty big. And we find a lot of space to store our clothes. Now over here, we got a desk, really nicely settled, just underneath the window. We also find a chair, a light, and as we mentioned, the window with this curtain, which has pretty, um, pretty much same exact views as we just saw from the previous bedroom. Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and check out the rest of the apartment. And we're gonna check out um, now bedroom number one, okay, where we got it attached literally to bedroom number two. Right guys, so um, bedroom number one over here, as we just mentioned, we got a really, really nice and big um, bedroom. Also, we got a lot of furniture and a lot of equipment going on, okay? So you can see too, we got this kind of floor, which as we said, uh, we got throughout the whole apartment, which makes it really, really modern. Decoration over here too is also super modern. And starting to this side, we find a double-sized bed, okay? We got bed lining, we got some towels included, which is always something Super nice to have. From the side, hanging from the ceiling, we got this um, light. We find two extra lights over here in the bed. We got a shelf over here and around the table with some decoration besides um, this right hand side of the bed. If we go over here, we got this standalone wardrobe, which is pretty, pretty big. So you can see um, in one of these doors, we got equipped also um, three mirrors, which are really, really big. So those are really useful and we can also open um, the wardrobe like this and we got plenty of space for our storage okay now turning to this other side we got first off a desk as you can see um literally brand new okay we got a chair we got a light we got um this picture over here and to the side to the top of this bedroom we find first off this window also can be covered up by this curtain and we got some really, really cool views of um, the avenue. Okay, so over here, as you can see, we got some really, really nice views. We also got a lot of trees, um, this kind of park area in the center of the avenue. And if we turn to this left-hand side, we see um, the station of Cabañal. Okay, so we got public transport really near, and we got the beach also going in a straight line over there. Okay. Now we're gonna go over here. And coming up from um, bedroom number one, we head into this space where we got bathroom number one. So we go inside 
and we see a really neat bathroom, super clean, really, really neat distribution. We find our toilets, we got a sink, some decoration over here. We got a mirror on the top with a light. To this end, we find the shower, okay, which is super clean, super neat. All right. And to top off this bathroom, we find over here the several different shelves where we can store our bath products. Now over here, we got kind of last part of the apartment, which is uh, bathroom number two. Okay, we find the sink, also really neatly decorated. We got a mirror on the top. We got some space on the bottom. The shower really nicely fit into this corner, as we can see. Okay, and over here we find our toilet. Okay guys, so this has been the visit for today. This has been Dennis from Sparahome. We're wearing you just over here and let's see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.